Hello, this is Ben Koenig from Address Professional Services and within this next video I'm going to quickly show you how to change your Inventor background for presentation purposes. The first thing you do is to select the Tools tab, then move on to Application Options and then within here you can select the Colors tab. From within the Colors tab you have a number of options. We can select a uh, standard colour, a gradient, which in this case we might look at the high contrast which is quite nice. But you've also the, also the option to be able to select a background image. If we select the background image, we've then the option to be able to choose the, uh, the file associated to that image type. If we use a drop down here, I've uh, created some custom backgrounds. So if I come into my uh, customization folder here, I can then pick up my Inventor Master background. In this case, you can see the different file types that are supported here. If I select OK, and OK on here, we then get the uh, more formalized background. So within Inventor, not only can we change the uh, background image, we can also change the reflection image that the model utilizes uh, for reflective materials. Okay, so by default, if we uh, were to rotate the model, you can see that we've got the car park reflective uh, background here. What we can do to change this is either to go to the View tab and to change the environment that we're using which associates a background for example the old warehouse alternatively we can change it independent of the environment to do this again you go to the tools tab application options go into the colors tab and down the bottom here we can see the reflection environment options now when I first saw this uh, I thought that you could only use this DDS file format but in fact if you were to browse here albeit it only selects the DDS you can actually navigate to uh, other file types so if we were to go back to the folder that we looked at uh, with regards to customizing the background if I were to say all files I can actually select in this case a bitmap select open okay and as you can see as we again move around the model we can actually choose as to which background image we want as a reflective uh, environment. 